So this second tool I'm going to show you about auditing workbooks is, is new to 2013. It's called Inquire. So if you look up to my screen here, I have Inquire. All right, Inquire. Now, some of us will not have it. I'll show you how you can get it. All right, so Inquire is, allows you basically to inquire. So let's, let's have a look. I've set up two uh, sheets. Let me show you what I've set up. I've set up a sheet called Original File. So this original file has data that I was working on. And then I created another one called, and I saved it as original file um, amended. So this original file amended, and then the other one is original file. So I just removed a few things. I mean, for example, look at this 511501. I could just type 20 in there, right? So I've made a change in here. I've just typed 20 in there, and, let, let, and I'll save Control S. So I've, I've done that. I've made a change. Let's go back to our workbook. Okay, so let's try and do an inquire, inquiry. So I'm going to inquire, and I'm going to compare files. So how do I get inquire in the first place? You go to File, Options. Once you go to File, Options, you go to Add-ins. You go to Add-ins. Once you get to add-ins, this is a com add-in. It's not a normal Excel add-in. If you look to the bottom, you see Excel add-ins. You change that to com add-ins and then click on go. This will bring a list of add-ins, com add-ins um, for, for you to load. You can see I have Power Pivot, Power Maps, Power Query, all sorts. So you basically tick inquire. This is inquire. You should have it if you have 2013. And definitely, if you have 2016, you have Inquire. Once you tick Inquire, click OK, and then it loads up here. Then I can do something like Compare Files. So if I click Compare Files, you would see this box comes up. It says Compare compare to what are we comparing? So obviously, once you do some changes, you, you probably take the reviewed one. So where is my reviewed? Uh, original amended. So this is my original file amended. I'm going to compare it to the original file. Now you can swap it. Are you comparing this against this or that against that? So, so I'm comparing these two files and I click on compare. What happens when you click on compare is the system basically goes through those two files and extracts everything there and does a detailed analysis and gives you a very clear detailed report that you could do a reconciliation on. So this is a perfect way to do reconciliation as well. So you could see how detailed this is. So you have the compared file. I have one file here and another file here, uh, comparing amended to original. And so you could see that 20 we just typed. Let me just zoom in. Okay, let me change. It's here highlighted in green. And you see what, what does green mean? Green means entered value. So you get this very nice detailed report. Okay, I just switched off the magnifier. It's not working that well. All right, so this is the detailed report. You have entered values, calculated values. You have every single item that was changed. Names, structural changes. So this is excellent for financial modeling as well. In fact, we use this when we teach model auditing. How do you audit a, or audit a model? There are two models. How do you audit them? This inquiry is an excellent, excellent tool. And it basically gives you a very detailed analysis of all the changes made to your workbook. And then you can save it and extract it into, you can export this results, for example. I'll just click on export. So it's going to export all this report into a report, and that report can be sent to the client, or, or you basically ask someone to review that report. I'm going to save the report on my desktop as inquire report, and save. So it's saving the report, and, and it, it saves a lot of time when you want to compare things that have, changes that have been made. It saves you a lot of time. Thanks for watching another training video from Deep Brown Consulting. See you in the next video.